All right, this is video two. Uh, this is a different model, but you can see the same structures up here that I just pointed out. So this tube, the tube that runs down the, the dorsal part of your, of your neck is the esophagus, and that's right here. The trachea entrance is right here, and we're not talking about that, so we'll just follow the esophagus. One thing, this is the epiglottis right here. This little flap, um, oh sorry, I lied. Scratch that, this is the epiglottis right here. Eh, I can make a mistake. So when you swallow, this thing will close down like this, and it'll kind of close off that, that trachea, so the food is kind of forced to go back down this back route. So as my noble cameraman moves the camera, <clears throat> I'll tell you that the esophagus has some layers of smooth muscle around it, and the inside is lined with, uh, with stratified squamous epithelium, which if you remember, is your same stuff that your skin's made out of, and it's really good against, uh, in protecting you against abrasion. So let's say whatever that, bo that ball of food that you swallowed, it's called a bolus of, of food. You swallow it down here, and then we reach the bottom of the esophagus right where the, the stomach meets it. And you might remember from AMP1 that slide that said gastroesophageal junction uh, that had several different types of tissues and made everybody crazy. Well, that's, this is that area right there. This sphincter, and now a sphincter is any circular muscle that closes off of a, a tube. The sphincter here at the top of your uh, stomach is called your cardiac sphincter because it's in the cardiac region or close to your heart. You might, you could also call it a gastroesophageal sphincter. It, uh, everybody's cool with either. So now the food enters the stomach here. You can see a couple of uh, these little ribs almost in the wall of the stomach. These are called rugae, R-U-G-A-E. And the rugae allow for expansion. So when you really gorge yourself, that stomach can stretch and the rugae uh, expand. The stomach also does a, a real good job of like mechanically digesting food. Um, it has a couple, it produces hydrochloric acid and a couple of enzymes. But largely, it's a mechanical digestion and storage, uh, storage region. region. Uh, when we get down to the very bottom down here, we've got the uh, second sphincter. Are we good? So this right here, this, this region uh, is, contains the pyloric sphincter. So cardiac sphincter up here, pyloric sphincter down here, and then the, the product that you've produced here is called chyme. C-H-Y-M-E, that chyme is going to be moved next into the duodenum, which is the first segment of the small intestine.